Hello, my name is Alexey. In this series of video tutorials we will learn how to build a website from scratch on Joomla 4. In previous video tutorial we create an About Us, Gallery and Portfolio page. In this video tutorial we will create contact page with Google Map and contact form. We will also configure Joomla email settings. Let's see, this is our website. There are several pages on it. And let's add a contact page here. First of all, I will create contact category. By default, there is already one category called uncategorized. You can leave it like, like that or just rename it. Now let's go to contacts and create new contact. I will call it Alexey. Here I can link user. I have one user. I can add it here and it will be enough for our contact form to work. But if you don't want to link any user, you just can click no user and enter email here. This is email of administrator. On this email will be sent all letters from this form. For example, I will add my test email. Also, you can add some information here. I already add some information. Also, we can change image. We can just I will upload it here, for example, my photo. Also, we can add some additional information just for test purpose. Save it. And let's create a menu item. Here we can add menu. This will be contact page. Here it is. It will be single contact. I will call this page just contact. Here we need to select our contact and just save it. Let's refresh our page. Oh, of course, I need to add headline just here. Contact, save. So, we can see our information, some additional information. We can see contact form, but I don't like this layout. So, I will disable this information. I show it for you just for test purpose. But I will add this information in other way. I will delete all of this. Let's update page. So we have just one, one contact form. In a few minutes I will change the layout of this page. But now let's try to send some mail. For example, name, for example, some email, subject, and some message. Let's send it, and we have an error. Also, I don't see any mail on my mailbox. So let's set up our email settings. Just close this. Back to Home Dashboard, Global Configuration. And let's look here. For example, I want to send mails from my Gmail box. This is just for example. In your case, when you upload your website to real hosting with real domain name, I strongly suggest you to change this from email to your email with your domain. For example, if I had a mail 
alexius.com. So my email will be email alexius.com. OK, let's check our settings. For example, leave like this and click send test mail. We have an error. So let's change our settings from PHP mail to SMTP. Now we need SMTP host. We can find it here. Just copy. This is our port. Here we can change SMTP security, SMTP with authentication, login will be our mail, and if I insert my password from my Gmail account, it won't work. Let's check. Yes, we have an error, couldn't authenticate, so we need to create a special password. Go to your Gmail account, manage your Google account, here switch to security tab, here we can add app password, here I have my previous app passwords, let's create new one, mail, other, let's call it for example Joomla 4.2, generate, copy this password and paste it here. Save settings and send test email. OK, we have success message. Look here and we have this. We have this email, so it worked just fine. Now let's change this layout. For example, add contact data here on the left. For this purpose I will look at my template settings here in the layout. I will see the position I need call left. Now just create site module. This will be custom type module call for example, contact us. Here I will pass my contact information. Select position left. Here it is. And I will assign this module only for one page. Just contact page. Save it. And after refresh our page we will see this layout. I like it much more better. Let's hide this name. For example, go to my menu, contact, and for the name just select hide. Update information. That's more better. Now let's add Google Map here. Also, we need to know some information. Here we can see some positions, bottom, bottom 2, bottom 3, but let's enable uh, this option and add here uh, this text. Here we can see position content bottom. It will be here. Or we can add map here. Just for test purpose let's check this and this position. Disable this. Now if we update our page we won't see this position even with this query. OK. Let's go to site model, create new model, call wrapper, it will be Google Map, here it will be published only on this page, 
here we can see content bottom position. We need to insert a URL of our point on the map, so open Google Map, find your location, for example, like this, push share button, embed map, copy this code, insert it here, but we need to leave just the URL without this code, so delete unnecessary part, save the page, let's refresh it, and we can see our Google map. Let's change high, example like this, so it looks much more better. Now let's move this module here. This is right position. So we have create contact page with contact form. You can add more information here or here. You can also add some information here as you like. And that's all I want to show you in this video tutorial. In the next video tutorial we will create a blog with comments, share buttons and YouTube videos. If you have questions, please leave them in the comments. If this video was helpful to you, please give it a like. Also, don't forget subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching, this is Alexey, see you soon in new tutorials.